Christmas everyone. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope that you and your family are having a spectacular day. Today I am going to share with you all my love, my newest love, which is the Fial Robin Konkin in the color sand. This is their mini backpack and I am so excited to share this bag with you all. As you know, I have a couple of videos already on my channel about this wonderful brand. If you remember, I <laughs> was really, really wanting this particular for y'all Robin Conkin sling. This is so much fun to carry. I do have a video on it. Please check it out. And you can see the size uh, comparison here. This cute little bag is going to be able to hold quite a few items. It has a little back pocket here. And if you want to carry a little bit more, then this will be your best bet. So for my everyday carry items, this is perfect. So let's get right into it. I have had this bag in my possession for about, I want to say a week and a half or so. I'm not quite sure. But before I received this bag, I went on ahead and I purchased the Fial Robin Konkin Mini in the color clay. And the reason I did this is because this bag could not be found anywhere. I even emailed the company and the company kind of referred me to the color clay saying that they were not going to get this bag back in stock. And so I did go ahead and purchase clay and I fell in love with clay. But in the back of my mind, I still really, really wanted that sand color. So I kept searching and searching and I looked up y'all, I found it on Macari. And when I found it, the seller had stock pictures of the clay one, but as you scrolled further, ended up showing that the one that the seller had for actual sale was sand and y'all it was brand spanking new it came in the plastic and the plastic said i don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see that sand on there i could not believe it i could not believe it and so i am so glad to have this bag in my possession because i know that this is a sought after color now that is discontinued and I think the last time it was sold was maybe 2018, 2019. I could be wrong about that, but I'm just so glad to have it because this color looks so good with my skin tone. And this color is more of a khaki color, which like I said, I was carrying it and loving it. But once I was able to get my hands on this, this kind of went into storage <laughs> and I'm enjoying carrying this. So let's go ahead and get started. I will say there's not many differences. I know that for y'all Robin does update their backpacks and their items every few years, but their quality remains the same. The quality is top notch, the stitching is top notch, and just the wearability of the bag is amazing. I feel like a spokesperson for them, and I'm not, I promise I'm not. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and get started. As you all can see, we've got these beautiful double zippers right at the top. I went on ahead, y'all, and I added my little lapel pin there. Y'all know I love, I love, love, love lapel pins. This particular one let me bring it in closer y'all it is actually a vintage pen sold through Avon I want to say back in 1997 I researched it because my husband found this at a thrift store and picked it up for me and I love that he did that so I went on ahead and placed it right here on my bag and I started to research <laughs> about this pen and I found a few more on eBay and even Poshmark so if you're a teacher like me or if you just want to thank a teacher this is a lovely little gift and it's vintage so I love this Next, you all see the lovely reflective logo here. It says for y'all Robin Conkin, and it's just iconic for the bag. These bags were made in Sweden, and they are so well made. So you've got the front pocket here, and you've got two side pockets. And that is what you're going to get for the outside of the organization. Let me show you the back. The back is set up in such a way where you're going to be able to enjoy carrying this backpack because I guess this particular 
pattern here, which is kind of makes a W, makes it easy to distribute the weight of the backpack on your bag. But I hardly have anything in this bag, so there's not much to distribute, but it's nice to know that they thought of that. So in this very front pocket here, I'm gonna go ahead and zip it. I've got just my mitts here. I have my lotion and I believe I have a lippy here. So this is a cute little front pouch for all of your little quick grab items that you want to reach really fast. And I love it. I love it. The zippers work great too. It's just really amazing. The top handles, of course, are something that <laughs> I can't live without. You guys know I love bags that have top handles. And this one is really great because you can secure the top handle with the button here. I hardly ever use it, but I like that that feature is there because if you're wearing your backpack and you're in a crowded area, you want to take every precaution to make sure that, you know, you know, muggers and <laughs> are not going to be able to go ahead and grab your things like pickpocketers aren't going to be able to grab your things quickly. So I love that little feature. I just leave it buttoned right here on the back and you all can see it has a little Arctic Fox there. Just really really nicely detailed in this bronze color. The way that the material feels, if you've ever felt a Konkin, it's, it's unlike any other backpack. It feels rugged and rough and just strong and sturdy. Like you can really take it here and there and it's gonna be durable for you and hold up for you. That's what it feels like. <laughs> okay, and so now I'm gonna go ahead and zip this down. I love this because it zips almost all the way down on both sides of the bag. And when you open it up, look how wide it opens up. Beautiful, you can see all my items here. And I'm not gonna take too much time going through these items. You guys have seen a lot of this stuff, so I'm just gonna quickly pull it out. But this is where I go ahead and house my cell phone. Here is my Kipling Creativity in the color Tango Red. I love the gold accents on this, and I think it looks so good with this bag. And here is my Kipling Gardenia in the pattern Cherry Glitz. I just keep a little book in here and some coupons. Here is my La Sport Set Toki Doki Micro Bag. I keep little odds and ends in here, and y'all know I love this. <laughs> this is so cute and adorable. Here is my Kipling Creativity in the size small. And inside, I just got my tissues on one side, and on the other side, I've got some little lippy items there. I love this. And then one of my newer items, I found at Dollar Tree and I could not resist y'all. You, you all know I love these little eyeglass pouches. I have a couple of different patterns of them, but what I love about them is how they open from the top and you can fit two glasses in here. I have my sunglasses in here and I also have my readers in here very comfortably. And it's like a coated canvas. But what I love about this pattern is the cute little fun sloths hanging on rainbows. This is too cute. I've never seen anything like this. And they're like unicorn sloths. <laughs> they are too cute. I used to have a sloth pin. And I can't find that lapel pin anywhere, y'all. It was in my Kipling City Pack mini video. I don't know what I did with that sloth lapel pin, but it was so cute. So here's the inside of the bag. You see it has the little seat pad back there. I do have my Sanrio characters pouch here. And inside of here are just my little feminine products. And I love this pouch because it can hold items flat and out the way. So it's really, really nice. I have my two pins kind of clipped back here. And I'm just gonna put everything right back in here and show you all just how easy it is to go ahead and pack this bag up and everything pretty much stays put while I'm carrying it. And it's just the ease for me. It is so easy to, to carry this bag and fun and cute. <laughs> so that's everything packed up. Go ahead and zip it up. Nice. Oh, I just love this. The zippers are really nice and strong and sturdy too. I like to leave them kind of like right here in the middle. One side says for y'all Robin and the other side has the picture of the Arctic Fox. Just too adorable. And then on this side, I've got my little um, hand sanitizer spray. I think I have some perfume in here too. I think that's it. Yep. That's it. So I like having easy access to those items 
On the other side, I've got my little lug pin kind of clipped here. I like the little gold accent with the brown. I think brown and gold looks so classic together. That's why I love having this little lapel pin on here. I think it looks so good. And then here I have my little makeshift key leash. I went on ahead and clipped it to the little D-rings back here and then it slides in so easily and I don't have to worry about, you know, them falling out or losing them popping back in you all because I totally forgot to share with you all the pros and cons of this beautiful backpack and I wanted to make sure that I did that because for me when someone shares their pros and cons that actually helps me decide whether or not I want to purchase the bag so let's jump right into the pros the pros of course I'm gonna say the color this color is so beautiful the brown tone is is perfect it is an actual true brown not a red brown not an orange brown a beautiful brown and it like I said earlier it looks so good <laughs> with my skin tone and it looks good with the color gold and I wear quite a lot of gold jewelry gold tone jewelry and I love the way that it complements it I also love the zippers. The fact that Fiyal Robin goes ahead and paints their zippers the same color as their bags, I think that is a perfect feature. And y'all know I cannot ignore the top handles. The top handles are a score for me because I would not purchase this bag if it did not have those cute little top handles. The side pockets are adorable. I love that they're actually not big enough for like a water bottle, just for your little little items here or there that you want to add in for easy access the front pocket is so cute like a little pouch on the outside to grab things that you need this bag is just so easy especially in the winter time because we've got our big furry hoods and just to throw it on makes it a breeze now let's talk about the cons so there is a con that I have for this bag the way that this bag is shipped to you whether you're getting it third party sites or brand new through the actual website, the official website, it comes with different wrinkles and folds in it. And I'm not a fan of that. I will say that as you carry it, the wrinkles and folds do disappear. However, if you have one of the darker colors, for example, the black color, the folds and the wrinkles and the creases, once they're created in the bag, they leave a white mark or a grayish mark, and it makes that bag look weathered or worn before it's time. I've seen a few videos of uh, people complaining of that. So that's something to be on the lookout for. And other than that, I am so pleased with this handbag. So this is my bag that I have been enjoying carrying this winter. And for the foreseeable future, I'm going to keep on enjoying this, y'all. I had been carrying my Herschel Mini Nova. And as you can see, it's like the similar size. So I love these types of backpacks in the winter time because winter time, you've got your fur hoods and everything. And so it's easy just to throw on a backpack as opposed to a crossbody. But I'm loving this bag, y'all, and thank you so much for sharing in my excitement as I was able to get my hands on the color sand in this beautiful, beautiful backpack. And thank you all so much for a wonderful year of watching videos that I have been showing you all. And I have just been enjoying reading all of your comments. Thank you so much for the sweetness that you all send out to me. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful new year. Grace and peace.